What's going on guys? We are back with another NASCAR Heat 2 career mode. Uh, going to Martinsville, so let's just get right into the race. Alright, so we're here. I uh, don't really have a setup, just make it loose, I guess. Because, yeah, I'm going to need that, so. Um, put that there. Okay, and let's put a pressure to 30. No, I'm gonna put them up to 35. Why not? Um, we should be able to win this race. Um, the AI for this track are pretty weak, I would say. Um, so hopefully we'd be able to win. But um, I don't know. Let's see where we qualify. Okay, coming up turn four. Uh, did not run a very good lap. Okay, 20 second, not bad. But we are on that. Put uh, to I would say about eh, 46 and a half. Uh, the car is extremely tight, so. Uh, so to the front. Um, car doesn't really want to. Really say. And don't have a lot of acceleration off the corner, but uh, what we can do. Okay, so with lap 8, there's 25 laps to go, and we're all the way up to 13th. Uh, no cautions yet. We're slowly gaining on the leader. It's a 5 second gap now, and about a lap or two ago it was 5.2. So we just need to, we need to get past a lot of these, um, a lot of these cars, because when we run behind them, we lose a lot of time on the leader. I've been noticing that. Oh, I overran that corner for sure. Okay, so 19 laps to go, and uh, we cut down this uh, gap to leader by a whole second, basically, which is really good. Uh, we're all the way up to maybe six, so we can get past Cody Coughlin here. Uh, we get past him, so we are all the way in the sixth spot, and we have plenty of room uh, space uh, between us and fifth place Christopher Bell as I overrun the corner. Um, uh, basically, we just need to keep running consistent lap times, what we've been running. Um, basically, and, um, we can be able to, we'll be able to catch up to the leader real quick. Uh, I believe we are coming to halfway this time. Only a few laps after. Okay. Uh, 19 out of 32 laps, 14 to go. Uh, I did horrible math there, but, um, uh, we're all the way up into fourth, maybe third, and about a second back of the leader. Um. There is lap traffic, so hopefully uh, the leader can get caught up in some and we can catch up to the leader. Uh, Going to be 13 laps to go this time. We're going to look under Minecraft in here. Uh, we get under him successfully. Pinches us down. Just pull out right in front of him. Uh, one and a half seconds back. I uh, see a big line of lap traffic here as we uh, lock up going turn three. Coming out of turn four, we get a good run off the corner. Uh, second back of the leader with 12 laps to go. Uh, keep running very, very high, but um, we should be able to get a run on first and second. Uh, first is stuck on the outside, and second is stuck on the inside between all of this lap traffic. Uh, I'm going to back out of that. I'm not taking that three wide. Uh, I'm going to go on the outside with the leader, um, maybe. <laughs> Uh, depends on where the lap traffic is, which is pro uh, lap traffic is probably going to run on the bottom, so. Frisco with shot going into the corner. I run that corner way high, and Matt Crafton gets under us, I'm going to let him go. Uh, going to be good last 10 laps. Um, should be really a shootout <laughs> between all of these cars. Uh, we got a good run out of the corner. Uh, Briscoe might be able to look under, or go under, I mean, uh, if he gets cleared enough, which he does not, but, uh, he has a big hole right there. Maybe he can break late. Ooh. Uh, gonna have to really get lucky to get under Briscoe. Um, even a little shot under here. That is Briscoe, right? Okay. I was really hoping that was Briscoe. <laughs> uh, I thought, uh, I was having thoughts that it might have been Zendrick, but I had to check there. Uh, we're... Go to the bottom, uh, between, or, oh, come on, Boyd, can't do that right there, I'm gonna have to 
Take it three wide to go for the lead right here. We are going to be able to take the lead with, what is that, seven laps to go? Okay, seven to go. And we already pulled away to a second lead. We should be able to bring this home. There's, maybe it's not going to be as easy as I thought. Uh, Joe Hunt, uh, John Hunter Nemechek is... Uh, oh, God. Okay. Well, we got a caution with three laps to go. Going to be two-lap shootout. Uh, hopefully, I can uh, just break the Hopefully, this is ending for me. Uh, I'm going to pull all the way up to the top. Uh, all the way up in the fourth gear already. And over on turn one. Should be able to get a run out of turn two, though. Which we do. Uh, already out to like a 5 tenth lead, so... I'm just going to run this high line, uh, get a good run out the corner all the time. Here we go. And get a really good run. So, we should be fine unless we fall. Jesus, that was close. Uh, yeah, we should be fine as long as we don't mess up going into this corner, which I'm going to get really nice and slow. Uh, okay, so now we get out the corner. And we get out the corner very nicely. We win. At Martinsville. Great. I believe that's what our second win on the season. Maybe. One at Daytona. Not. But I know we won at Atlanta. I cannot remember. Cause it's been a while since I've done career mode. Um, we win the race. Uh, I really don't care about the bank at all. Uh, let's see. We're. Uh, we do have all the wins, and we got a lot of playoff points. Um, okay, yep, yeah, there's the trophy. We slap, but really good day at Martinsville. All right, guys. So after that Martinsville race, uh, we got an offer from the '98 uh, Xfinity car uh, at Bristol. So let's get right into it. Uh, here we are for qualifying. Uh, just gonna try and make a quick lap here. Um, so you can get a good uh, good lap. Um, hopefully we can, just so we can get a decent starting position so it's not that hard for us. But um, let's see it going down into one. Um, okay, there we go. Cut the corner very nicely. Um, got right down to the edge. Uh, I'm going to slide into turn two. Uh, make sure we don't hit the apron. Um, I'm going to let off the gas just a little bit there, but um, qualified 24th, and all we need to do is finish 25th, so that is great. It is a setup I'm going to rock with. I'm going to bump everything down by one click and uh, get uh, mess with the springs. Um, yeah, so hopefully we can do good uh, at Bristol, get a top 25 finish, but green flag is out, and uh, we are underway at I believe the Food City 300, I believe. I'm not for sure. Don't count on me for that, but uh, I believe that's the race that it is. But, uh, yeah, let's just try and finish good. But, um, all right, so I came back at lap 10, 30 laps to go. Uh, there wasn't really much going on in the race. Um, I moved all the way up to 11th. Yeah, it's pretty, boring. It's, it's pretty easy. Uh, all we did is really just pass a bunch, like, we probably passed two to three people a lap. It was extremely easy. Uh, I tried to be as clean as possible, but um, I, only, I only got into the back of a few people. Nobody spun, no cautions or anything. But um, uh, we get on the side of Suarez there. Almost hit Blake Coke, I think. I don't know how to say his name. But uh, underneath Harvick for the spot. Uh, going to try and get a little side draft going into the corner. But, uh, yeah, all the way up into 8th place. Um, we're all the way up into 7th place. I believe this is on lap... Uh, I can't remember, actually. <laughs> uh, this is... Uh, first race is uh, live com. This is post com. Uh, I think I'm going to be doing a lot of uh, post com videos so I can actually focus on what I'm doing. But, um, yeah, we try and pull down right there, but uh, Olga really just filled that gap real quick. We ride the apron there to get underneath uh, Daryl Wallace. Um, slide up right in front of him. Uh, just get a little bit of contact, but we pass uh, him and Sadler uh, on the low side, and we are all the way up into fifth place on 
Oh, I don't remember what lap this is because I got the little leaderboard there. Um, but uh, it's going. I mean, the race is great. All we need is top 25, and we're, we are in fifth position. So uh, I really didn't know what lane to use because uh, the inside and outside could uh, be a good lane. But I decided to use the inside, but like, uh, like, like actually run the inside. But uh, coming down to seven laps to go, we're in third. We passed Byron. Um, and Ty Dillon and uh, Brandon Jones kind of followed us, but um, there's no way we're gonna end up winning the race because Brandon gone seven seconds in front of us. Um, maybe we get a second place finish uh, in front of Jeremy Clements, but that is very unlikely to be honest. Um, you know, let's just be honest, it's very unlikely. Um, yeah, hopefully we can just um, just get a good finish, but. While I'm talking, uh, I'm going to be announcing that uh, on, <sighs> Jesus Christ, I don't remember the fucking date, now i got to look it up, <laughs> um, yeah, Jesus Christ, on Tuesday, January 2nd, because I am uh, doing this video on January 1st, so Happy New Year, um, but on January 2nd, I'll be creating a new channel just for other stuff other than racing. But uh, coming down to the last uh, corner right here, we will finish in third at Bristol. But uh, yeah, so going on to the new channel, um, I will put a link on Twitter, um, a link on Twitter to go to that new channel. Uh, I'll tweet about it. Uh, uh, I'll tweet about it probably, um, probably about 3 p.m. Eastern time, uh, around there, Eastern time, so find out whatever time that would be for you, uh, but 3 p.m. Eastern time, I believe that's 12 Pacific, um, that nah, shit, I'm not even if I can get it, but, uh, I know it's 12 Pacific time, so that's over California and everything, but, uh, uh, next race will be at Kansas, um, Kansas for, uh, the truck series, but, uh, yeah. Dropping a new channel, um, I'll let you know on Twitter, I'll drop a link, but uh, yeah, if you guys like and enjoyed the video, like, comment, and subscribe on the video, uh, tell me how good I am, and what I can do on improvement, but um, leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I will talk to you all later, peace out.